to be like one of the, like, I guess you could say one of the stage commentators, but I don't go to PM terms that much, so I'm just trying to go to Smash 4 now. We're and both wearing extra headphones. Oh my god. Yo, wait. No. Can I do this? Can I do Nope. Yes, I'm, I'm gonna try. Don't I'm gonna try. I'm gonna try. Alright, so we have Cloud and oh, Corrin. Uh, this is actually a team that uh, beat us to oh, send us the losers. Really? Yep. Wait, so wait, wait, wait. they're still in there. So that's oh, good. They, wow. didn't, they didn't drop a single set. So Ooh, are you I'm kidding happy me? about that. Wow, that's, that's so impressive. I did not know that. We wow. lost to at least second place, and I'm proud of that fact. Yeah. <clears throat> and then one thing I've actually noticed, I don't know if anybody's touched on this on the commentary yet, but uh, if you've ever noticed Meself, any team that he does has, like, I, I, I feel like he almost forces the other person to use an energy projectile just to heal him. Yeah, I mean, like... Did you ever notice that? I kind of noticed that. I mean, <laughs> last time I saw him with the team, like, he was teaming with the Yoshi, and I don't think that's actually Oh, you're right. Work, you're right. But... Yeah, that doesn't work. Yeah, but you could... You do make a point, though. I mean, like, lately, the one I've seen uh, him anyway, but... Uh, that's going to be amazing. We're going to see some nice teamwork from Corrin and Ness. And then... Hopefully, nice teamwork from Corrin and Cloud, too. There are two Corrins in here. Yes. Uh, we got pink haired waifu, we got black haired waifu. <laughs> All right. So we got we got lucky number five, Misa, coming from the loser side. Both on green team, we got Corrin and Ness versus Nosley and Athene. Corrin and Cloud on the red team on the winner side. Now, with Corrin and Cloud, it's actually, I find this kind of an interesting team because Corrin has potential to be a really good team partner, and if you're not, like he already is. But Cloud, like he also has it. So, but I feel like both of these characters are kind of both on the defensive side. Wow. Ah, they learned that. that was, <laughs> they taught They learned that from us. Nice counter for them looking at the Oh, beautiful follow up by Nosebleed there. Getting that first stock off of Ness. And we see uh, uh, Lucky Number 5 charging his forward smash there at the edge. Uh, which is sometimes smart because Ooh, it can, uh, yeah, the shield break on Cloud. Oh, okay, cool, but uh, you're being safe. But uh, charging that up, it actually has that active hitbox too, yes. when she holds her sword out before that. So it's actually a pretty decent edge guard, comes with a lot of options. Yeah, I do that. Uh, and uh, then no, lucky number five hitting himself with the paralyzing glass with the amazing. Dragon Fang shot. <laughs> dragon Fang shot. Ooh, nice Ooh. backer by me. Core on core in action, guys. Um, <laughs> Oh, okay, so, um, so it's four stocks to five, but I think it is at Kill Pretender right now. And I feel like Misself could actually take care of him. Right? But also, the, look at number five. But, with the but you see Nosebleed well. covering uh, yeah. Athena pretty, pretty safely there. Yes. Let me say that. Ooh. I am really liking their teamwork, Athena and uh, Nosebleed. Yes. That's actually really good. <laughs> All right, we got a nice strength Cloud on this. Oh, this could be. Ooh. Nice oh. forward smash. Yeah. With like of course force match, it's just like an all round great option. Like with any like any situation, especially with the edge running. I'm not sure how we killed the force match before, like when he said the great left, but probably killed because of a good read. Ooh, there we go. Nice See, tipper. And just the and the range is kind of kinda of deceptive on that too, especially for how little lag it has. Like it has a decent amount of lag on it, but not as much as an attack that reaches that far short. Also, we saw taking the stock. I'm not sure if I agree with that. I mean yes I know that it should, it's like it's better. Actually, it's better to do 2v2 versus 2v1. But yeah, corn was at 100, like 100 percent Like you could have died really fast. Yeah. So I don't know. So, I, I I don't agree with that opinion at all. This is looking pretty grim for myself right now. Yeah. That's what it's make up four stocks. <laughs> yep. Now are they gonna go for the for throw into cloud limit break? Oh, uh, possibly. We see those be actually charging up that limit break. He might do it. He might be doing it just to have it though. Oh, or he misses the side view, okay. <laughs> okay, yeah, just kind of throwing it out there. Yeah, th I think they just miss it around a bit. Just a little Playing bit. Playing with their food just a little bit before they just end this. I don't know, though. You should not take yourself lightly. <laughs> oh, oh nice, nice. Nice side B by Athene. Yeah, I, I don't see that move you actually been using as a commentary. I mean, not as a commentary. As an edge guard that much. But that's actually, like, if you think about it, that's actually a really good option. For yeah, absolutely. Stage. Especially if you uh, wait a little bit before you use it, because then you dip down and you can yes. reach below the stage. Also, you could also, like, uh, what's it called? You can do the side beam to the stage, and, like, right before they grab the ledge, you can hit them so they actually get, like, a, so you get, like, a stage break. Yeah. That's also really good. Now, do you think we're going to see a switch from Lucky Number 5 and Miso? Um, I'm not sure about Lucky Number 5, because I do not know that much about the player, but I know Miso is probably going to save Ness. Yeah. I see that for sure. Um, I don't think there's gonna be a character switch though. Yeah. Oh, oh maybe. For yeah, myself. I. Who else is? Myself has a fox, right? Maybe. I think he does. I'm not so sure. Well, hopefully this switch could actually make it. Make it up for him. He's thinking about it right now. Got that hand on the mouth. 
intense thinking. <laughs> For those that are just tuning in, we are at a. We are at a okay, we're at, for Glorious Fridays at ATA, all that in a bag of chips. <laughs> Uh, <laughs> we're at Grand Finals team. Dan, Dan and Fluff are dying for some reason. I uh, I am actually a little confused right now. Um, I'm sorry, everybody. Uh, uh, so this is why it's not you forget. It's focus on it. Okay, let me let me repeat myself. Okay, so everybody that's tuning in, welcome to Twitch.tv slash Colorado Smash. We are currently hosting for Glory Fridays doubles. Uh, all that in a bag of chips. We see we have grand finals right now, and we see a switch. That's to right. We self plays Captain Falcon he occasionally. Does? I uh, I disagree with that choice entirely. Yeah, I kind of disagree with that too. Um, I'm it's not, Ness is yeah, just a better character. Yeah, just is. And, but that's okay. We'll see what's gonna happen. Uh, you know, he might surprise us. Might throw something. He might know something we don't. Yeah. So, <laughs> I mean, there are grand finals, and we're not. That's true. That is one. That is 100% true. Yep. We got knocked out by Nosebleed and Athene. But enough about that. We're gonna go to Dunk Hunt for game two of Grand Finals. Dunk Hunt is what Dunk you said. Hunt. Dunk Hunt. So we're gonna see some dunks. <laughs> <laughs> All right, here we go. Okay, Classic starting off trying to get oh. uh, that down tilt from uh, Cloud. He's also trying to get that dash grab. Uh, that's oh, he gets to grab this time. Actually, like hitting working number five. Now, this kind of stage, I think, uh, benefits Green Team. Maybe a little bit more. Yeah. Uh, I wouldn't say by much at all, but yeah, maybe just a little bit more. I agree with that. Uh, you're giving Captain Falcon a little bit more space to run. Um, he's got a couple platforms to mess around on. Um, and then Cloud can jump, but not very well. Like, it's it's an okay jump. It's not spectacular. We see here, we see here Nosebleed trying to go for that, what's it called? The delivery break. Well, I think he tries to cover him as well. Oops, there we go. Nice down smash Ooh. by Athene. Getting Falcon off the stage. Ooh, edge guarding Falcon at the moment. Gets a stun. Can't get anything about it. Ooh, misses. I think he was trying to get the, the, the stick hitbox of that side B. So like I said before, that, that, that side B to the ledge is extremely good. Oh, yeah. Oh, oh that does not kill yet. Oh, okay. Lucky number five getting a little uh, little anxious with that counter there. Yes. Uh, Misal getting a little confused about which corn he's attacking. <laughs> um, I don't know. Uh, I wouldn't see, like, this is... I feel like this game's kind of awkward. Oh, and Misaf accidentally kills Lucky Number Five with his side B. And then uh, Nosebleed has more than half a limit charged up right now. Okay, I like that. Nice up throw. Um, Misaf almost caught onto that up throw to try to capitalize on that. Oh, and then Nosebleed has the limit charge. A limit break. Possibly Are we gonna see? Uh, I think we're gonna see side B again. Or do you uh, think he's gonna hold it for a while? I don't know, but I feel like he wants to end Misaf's slot though. Yeah, that'd probably be smart. Uh, actually, this percentage, he can end it, yeah, just oh, yeah. like that. I was just about to say that. <laughs> <laughs> Albert. And now Corrin is actually at kill percentage with that finishing touch. Oh, yeah. Those will be holding on to the slumber break. Yeah, both of them, uh, actually, both red team. Neither of them has lost a sock yet. Oh, yeah, sure that. Okay, nice up throw. I actually respect that option. Oh, but gets, yeah, gets killed with the side B. Now, the reason I respect the up throw, even though a lot of people think it's a terrible move, is because it gets you, you know, it gives them a bug cloud. And that's where Cloud wants them, especially yes. you know, to juggle them. Yes, exactly. Cloud has extremely good anti -airs. And he's got the speed to follow up on the weird angle of throwing the mat, too, yes. so it just works. Oh. All right. Ooh, interrupts that side view. Nice back there. Oh, it is just the end of the... Never mind. Ooh, I feel like... Ooh. Ooh. That was so unfortunate to hit his partner with that. Wow. Okay, we got Nair. Ooh. Okay, fine. Finally taking out Athene's yeah. first stock for the side beat. Yeah, so the stock counts even, but the uh, percent uh, deficit yeah. is pretty large right now. Oh, Both nice, nice edge guard with the blade beam limit break. Now, Corrin is also like, like up. Oh my oh. gosh, that was a beautiful combo. Wait, did they both? Did they both impel Misa for the side beat? No, it was uh, Cloud. Uh, Cloud knocked him down with his down air, uh -huh. and then uh, Athene impaled both Misa and. Uh, uh, lucky number five with that. Uh, I see. Okay. okay, Cloud has limit again. Yes. Oh, um, the counter. Oh, wow. Take like it counter. out, Cloud Stock. Oh. That was, I'd say, pretty risky, though, with uh, Misa being that high on the side yes. right now, though. And they're slowly bringing this back, actually, because we have a stock even game. Stock even game, the percent deficit's not nearly as bad as it was. But when, they can uh, bring this back. Absolutely. Yeah, it wasn't nearly as bad as the last time we saw yes. that uh, the stocks were even. Okay, so maybe this. Oh, oh, gets tries to uh, gets a follow up on the like, stun. Okay, so maybe Vsol switching the Falcon. It's actually kind of working out for him. Oh, oh. unfortunate. Okay, get, oh, oh, oh nice DI. Okay, down throw. 
hits the duck. All right, so right now, green team's at kill percentage for, honestly, either of their up airs. Yes. Kill them. Uh, because Corrin has a deceptively strong up air. It's so... Oh, oh it's that'll kill. Up, yeah. I love, love that victory because it's so unexpected. Like, it's so sneaky, I love it. All right, now are we going to see... Uh, yeah, we're going to see Corrin doing the edge guarding right now. We'll clutch uh, our slippery. Oh. Okay. Um, All right, Corrin, no wall jump. Uh, didn't use side B to try to jump back up again. I don't agree with that. I, I, I don't agree with that counter off stage. So, so weird. I think maybe it was miss input, but yeah. You know. But still, uh, good showing on uh, Green Team bringing that back a little bit. Yes. Um, so right now we're uh, 2-0. Uh, basically, lucky number five and myself have to win six games in a row now. Yes. <laughs> well, almost in a row, like, at least three in a row. Yeah. And now they're to going to the bracket. signature counter pick, Omega on it. Omega on it. Ooh, still Falcon. Okay. Oh, okay. With how it worked out last time, actually, I don't disagree with this choice as much. Yeah. I mean, like at first, oh. it was, it, at first it was a bit of like a strange choice because you don't see like Misa use talking that much, right. especially in grand finals where you want to win. But like afterwards, you see like it actually helped him a lot, evening up the game more. Ooh. Oh, and I, yeah, we've seen Athene using that almost uh, all throughout this tournament. He's going to almost hug the edge and then try to fade out an attack for you just to get that counter on because he knows he can make it back at that range. Uh, so one thing I actually want to notice, uh, one thing I want to point out is Corrin's neutral air. I mean, not neutral air, neutral B. Oh, that finishing touch won't kill him just yet. But like I was saying, okay, I was about to say. Of course, neutral B. It's actually kind of interesting because it's a very good projectile on it. It's really big and it covers a lot of area. It's that but very it, big projectile with the bite at the end too. Yes, but also like when if you like, it's really easy to clank with. Like, like, if yeah, you hit it on the shield, it does like no shield slot. Absolutely, it's uh, Corrin's neutral B and Bayonetta and smash is pretty much the same way. Yes. In that, in that anything will break them. So it's like hitting a Hadouken. Ooh, nice getting that first stock off of, uh, lucky number five. Yeah. Uh, but everybody's so close in percent right now that it's still, still an open game. Let's go for a down. I'm not sure that was. Athene taking a risky, risky oh, up attempt. Lucky number five accidentally killing his teammate right there. That's unfortunate. Oh, okay, nice jab by Noseweed. Actually, kind of impressed to see Noseweed like get finals because he's a, more of a PM melee player. See him like in a grand finals in Smash Four. That's pretty cool. Yeah. Maybe those, that's kind of the atmosphere of those games try to transfer to Smash 4. That is a possible thing. Coins still have three stocks, wow. Yeah, well, the theme. The theme's corn. Because the other corn's at one stock, lucky number five. Oh, wow. Ooh, gets that side. Oh, wow. Ooh, Here we get nice side B counter on that side B. He finally uses his first stock. Ooh, and that's unfortunate. Lucky number five is just throwing these forward smashes and it's hitting me self more than it's hitting anybody else. Just to get the edge guard on Cloud. Oh. Didn't really need a down there because Cloud's cover is poor. Yeah, Ooh, reached that roll. That was really nice. If Nosebleed read how greedy he was getting, though, he could have easily have uh, reversed that upbeat and taken him with him. Uh, ending another Falcon stop. Oh, we got down throw in there. Um, a weak hit, a weak hit box of the upbeat. I mean, not the side of the forward air. <laughs> yeah. And did you see how Nosebleed was hovering towards the edge uh, when the theme was out there and then when he realized he could make it back, he instantly went back to try to kill lucky number five? Yes. Oh. That's really good team awareness. And we're dropping some frames right now. Oh. Should be a little chuggy. Okay, nice forward rush. Oh. oh, wow. Ooh. Okay, I did not realize. Oh, okay, now we're even. Ooh. Oh, wow, I have not noticed the stock this game, This game's tide has changed pretty quickly now. <laughs> but is this possible with Cloud, with the 2v1? Absolutely. It's possible with almost any character. Yes. But especially like Cloud. Okay. Ooh. All right, as long as he plays kind of, plays kind of patient, um, we, we know looking at this that lucky number five is probably going to stay back uh, just because he's at that percent right now and Cloud can kill at such a really good sense. Oh, just to get that down throw forward smash. Yeah, Misa being the aggressor right here. And then uh, lucky number five is just throwing smashes out there, kind of hoping they'll connect, which with Falcon covering you, you can kind of do that and then not worry about it too much. Now, if. Ooh, okay. Oh, he's got, oh, a limit. got a limit. So, this is, uh, if he hits a limit, it's going to kill either of those two. Oh. Oh, that's very unfortunate. I'm not sure if he actually wanted the side B. I think he wanted the side B. Uh, yeah, side B's a more reliable killer, leaves you less open. Oh, wow. Okay. Okay, definitely still open. This is actually. This actually might be looking like. Okay, so, it's Cloud versus Falcon. Uh, I do not know what to say about this, but I would know, like, both these players' hearts are up. Mm -hmm. must be beating rapidly right now. Absolutely. If they both know that, you know, one good uh, you know, up air to start it or up tilt, uh, cloud, maybe even a jab to like grab from Falcon will probably end this match. Yes. 
Especially because like if they if Nosby gets this, then they win grand finals. But Misa wins, they can still have a chance of winning the grand finals. So getting the racket reset. Nice fourth throw. Ooh tries to get that down air. Ooh, yeah, does not get it. That. I want to say it's almost a questionable down air, just yeah. because he's uh, kind of just going out and throwing it. He's not really waiting down for the throw. moment. Ooh, just to get that near. Oh, nice limit. Now, oh, oh, that could have been it right there. I feel like the best option, option to use is, I feel like the neutral be at most, because like, yeah, oh, dang. Because like, like, I wouldn't say like right there would be good, but like, while they were still in the neutral, just dashing around, I feel like if we just threw it out, Unexpectedly, it actually could have hit. I still believe side view would probably be the better choice. Uh, just because you have no lag, and then if he's right next to you anyway, you can usually follow up with attack because most people drop Ooh, the shield right after. Nice. nice. Over B. Nice. We see Cloud hitting the screens. <laughs> wow, good job by Miself. All right, so we have... I have a... So Miself and Lucky Mark 5 are still in it. They turned that around just so abruptly yes, at the I, end, too. I, not, I didn't even notice the stock count. Yeah, I was, a little, I was a little surprised at the end there. Yes. But, uh, hey, good on him. Hopefully they can pull, out, pull this out for the rest of the set. Right. Might we see a character switch? No, guess. I don't, so. I don't think we're going to see yeah, one. Yeah, I don't think uh, so. That was close enough that it would, yeah. I don't think it would warrant it. Yeah, but you never know. Yeah. <laughs> you never know. We aren't the players. You don't know what's going through their minds at the moment. Maybe it's just, I don't know. <laughs> Possibly talking. Oh, they're probably thinking about stage runs at the moment. Yeah. Yeah. We got Fluff the Juice Box, Four Glory Fridays, 32. Thanks for watching the stream, everybody. Oh, it actually says 32 now. It, did, it does say 32. I didn't notice that because it always has like a complicated number. Oh, okay. <laughs> All right, so we have some intense inner debates going on right now between all the players. Possibly. Uh, oh. You being a cloud player and having somewhat knowledge of corn, what do you think the best uh, counterpick stage for Nosebleed and Athene would be right at the moment? Smashville. <laughs> Smashville or Battlefield. I agree. Um, but at the same time, with uh, myself being Falcon, Battlefield's also his best stage. Oh, where are we going? But I'd say... Talon City? Okay. okay. That's yeah, actually, no, Smashville. I can see I can see with Corns, I can see Talon. Yeah. Um, just because the counter will kill earlier as well as the up air, which is, like I said before, it's definitely helpful. All right. See if green team can pull this through. Nice side B. Hitting both. And I think Misov got confused with the core. <laughs> I don't know. Yeah, we've been seeing that a lot. Oh, nice neutral air. Especially during the, the duck hunt match. Wow. Okay, solid damage. Yes. Nice juggles. Yes. Oh, uh, really? You, like... Kind of even right now, but Corn does still have only 11%. Yeah, lucky number five almost died to that up smash. Ooh, but Cor uh, oh God, Nosebleed has his limit though, which will kill. Nice force smash by Athene waiting out the counter. Okay, ooh, looks like he wants to end me up right now. Okay. They need to because, uh, you know, as everybody always says when they're commentating, Falcon with Rage, too real. Too real. I, I agree with that. I yeah. agree with that. Oh, yeah. He's, I, oh, there you I go. experienced that today. <laughs> and then um, a little a little personal note. I'm a little disappointed to see nobody's going for the balloon. Um, but that's, a, that's an issue for another time. Yes. I feel like... Right. Let's see if uh, Green Team can bring this back. Um, uh, looking, looking at the way they seem a little almost uh, almost disoriented right now. Yeah. Oh, wow. Dean only has 45%. What well, with that three stocks? Let's see Cloud charging his limit up. Yeah, you, see, you can tell uh, Nosebleed's feeling himself. He's thrown out a few more uh, forward smashes than I think uh, than I think he normally would. Oh. And, and right, nice, nice down air by number five. Oh. Ooh, misses the side beat. Wait, what? Did he still hit? No, uh, okay. Athene, Athene Sports. Okay, that's what I thought. <laughs> yeah. Ooh, this is the back of the edge guard. And accidentally kills. Nope. Oh, wait, nope. no. He kills only okay. Cloud, doesn't kill his partner. Nice. So risky, but it paid off. Especially at Corinth for something right now. I feel like one more of those that I can actually kill. There it is. Nice downer. Oh. All right, then see, that's what I was talking about with the up throws with Cloud. Oh, yeah. Just get him oh, wow. up there, get him on the platforms. Oh, wait, did he just counter a Falcon? I think yep. he just countered a Falcon Punch. Wow. Okay, oh, wow. Those leading the thing taking it. So far in this game, they're taking a lead. It is, it is looking very grim for Lucky Number 5 right now. 
With the amount of stocks they have left, I'm pretty sure like they might want to try to style or something. <laughs> oh, okay, that's he it. tried. He didn't touch ledge. That could have been a punish and a half. For yes. Oh, up throw. See if he can get some struggles like you were talking about. Definitely not. At this point, I think they're just trying to find uh, a creative way to finish him. Yeah. Oh, there okay. We go. There we go. And congrats to Nose right. and Athene, the Boulder Boys, I should say. Taking, taking four Glory Fridays, 32 doubles. Uh, fun fact Athene's birthday's today. Oh, yeah. Nosebleed's birthday yesterday. Indeed. So, happy birthday to Athene and Nosebleed. Uh, winning the tournament, winning yes. a little bit of money. So, uh, happy birthday. Happy birthday, guys. And then Athene giving thanks, you know, like, you know, he's a nice guy like that. Yes. I like him. So I believe we're gonna start with some singles. Some singles action. I love some singles. hot singles ready to mingle. Local singles, and you're not. Ah, there we go. Oh, okay. So who are we gonna see on stream? This is actually I love singles so much. Oh, oh, we're gonna see Nosebleed, and I'm not sure who this player's tag is. This is X. No, that's not X. That's not X. My bad. Uh -oh. 